Okay, so it's like 1.30 in the morning. <clears throat> uh, it's kind of bored, and I just made a pretty simple LM555 timer circuit. Just made it flash an LED, and uh, it's kind of like a flash once every two or three seconds. Um, I tried to copy the heartbeat because I hooked it up to a subwoofer here, a little mini subwoofer, and it makes a heartbeat sound. So, here we are. Um, just move this over to the sub. Whoops. Forgive me. Okay. So it's actually faster than it was on the LED. Now it's a heartbeat. It's crazy. And see, power supply is switching from constant current to constant voltage. So eventually just slows down and stops and sits in constant current. Um, so I'm just going to put in a filter capacitor to filter out the DC. It just lets the square wave through, square wave through from the LM555 and now it matches the frequency before that it was on the LED. And then take it off and we are back to that rapid frequency change and the heartbeat again. Now, the cool part here though is after that does that for a bit, you can plug it back in to the LED and you'll notice that the LED does not come on right away. It actually just kind of fades in. It's a two-stage fade. Um, pretty sure it has something to do with the two capacitors there on the trigger. Um, they're just two, uh, two 10 microfarads in parallel to give me a five microfarad um, trigger. But yeah, also this is now back to normal, almost. After like 30 seconds, it flashes on and off again. But yeah, that's it. Okay, bye.